I am Top Orlando Realtor Scott Garrison with Remax Town & Country. We're at 8775 Sartori Street, number 309, Orlando, Florida, 32829. That's S-A-R-T-O-R-I, Sartori Street, here in the Horizons at Vista Lake, up on the third floor. The purpose of this video is to give you what you can't see if you look at the best pictures online. ZillaRealtor.com, Trulia, Redfin. Give you a feel for what it's like to actually live here. Got a community pool that's around the corner. I wouldn't exactly say walking distance, but you know, like a 30 second drive. There is access to the Vista Lakes main pool for a small fee. I don't know what the small fee is, and that's also a short drive from here too. Community is gated. The HOA is $286 a month plus $56 a month total. And the taxes are $3,208. So around the back of the building here. You can see we're at the end. Got the old Florida woods right there. Got the three stories. This property was built in 2005 and at only $240,000. Gonna go up those stairs. I'll save from having to watch me climb them. Okay, now we're at the top of the stairs. Those are three flights of stairs. So you got to be fit, but that's part of living on the third floor. Three bedrooms, two baths, 1,408 square feet. That's a parking lot where we started, right down there, down there, all the way down there. And let's go in. So we come to unit 309, welcome home. Three bedroom, two bath, split plan. Got a new hot water heater, new dishwasher, which I guess they didn't bother to match. Nice counters. Original cabinets from 2005. I would prefer the door opening the other way so you don't lock yourself out of the kitchen. New microwave as well. Now we've got a Nice size, regular, master bedroom. For 1,408 square feet. It's nice, but that's definitely not spacious. But then again, the price is also smaller too. Third floor will give you some higher ceilings. That closet could use a little California closet if you're going to live here. View's not bad, for sure. That's a southern exposure, so you always get some good light. It's in good shape. It's been painted. There's not a mark on the wall. A lot of these properties are good rental properties. It's a nice neighborhood. This is also the price range for rental properties. This one feels like a rental property. That was rented. Nice green porch. There's your view. Got the world's largest crepe myrtle growing right here.
Got a little closet. Just a little closet. For coats and stuff. And then we've got two bedrooms over here. And it's not bad flooring. That's like a laminate flooring, but it certainly looks good. That's not a small room. The middle room was a little office or nursery size. This is a pretty good size here. Give you a feel for it. Room for a king bed. Plus, big closet here again. And then this is the shares a bat of door. Goes out to the hall as well. That's plastic, which means it's easy care. It's another little closet. So as far as what you get for uh, an affordable property, this is about as affordable as you get. It's still nice. All the good features. Make a great rental. Could live here too. It's got nice tile, no carpet anywhere. Definitely a good one. If you're looking in the 240 range, which is pretty hard to do. If I can help you with this one or any others here in Vista Lakes or Horizons, call me, Top Orlando Realtor, Scott Garrison with Remax Sound and Country. And before we end, I forgot to get the utility room. Right next to the kitchen, includes the washer and dryer. Got an AC, it's not new, it's not old. All right, now we're really done. Okay, for real, bye-bye.